Bonjour my friends, I'm Frankie and welcome to Club Foodie. French cuisine is popular worldwide. Like many other countries, this cuisine has incredibly amazing dishes coming from different parts of the country. In southern France, there's a port city where many meals were created around the catch of the day. In today's episode, I'll show you my version of bouillabaisse à la Marseillaise, using fish and shellfish with a lovely soup base, this peasant fish stew is so flavorful. It's very easy to make and the results are exceptionally tasty. So my friends, let's get cooking. First, we'll make the broth. So in a large pot over medium heat, we'll add oil. When it's hot, we'll add fennel, sliced leeks, red onions and chopped garlic. We'll give a good stir, cover and cook for five minutes. All right, so now that our ingredients are softened, we'll add the tomatoes, tomato paste, orange peel, but you can always use a fresh orange strip, three to four sprigs of thyme, fresh chopped dill, some saffron threads and cayenne pepper. We'll stir the ingredients very, very well and let it cook for two minutes. Next, we'll add white wine, stir again, turn the heat to high and cook for five minutes, stirring occasionally. After the wine is cooked up, we'll add about six cups of boiling water. Then we'll add the fish carcass. Now, if you have fish heads or shrimp shells, add them as well. This is what gives such a great flavor to the broth. To this, we'll also add a handful of parsley, one bay leaf, some ground Himalayan sea salt, and freshly ground black pepper. We'll stir again, bring the broth to a full boil, and cook for five minutes, stirring often. Now, we'll reduce the heat to medium-low and gently simmer for 45 minutes. Three quarters of an hour later, we'll remove the fish head, carcass, and shells, then discard them. We'll do the same with the sprigs. We'll use an immersion blender and process until fairly smooth, because what we'll do next is to strain the broth through a fine sieve sitting over another pot. We'll gently press it to extract any remaining liquid. After we're done, we'll end up with a beautiful, rich broth. We'll bring the heat to medium-high, and when it starts to boil, we'll add the firmer fish. In my case, I used sea bream, tilapia, and sole. So, sea bream will cook first before I add my two other fish. I usually cook each of them in an interval of one and a half to two minutes. So, every couple minutes, I add another one until they are cooked. Then after, I carefully remove them so they don't overcook. Now, if you're using shellfish, just like with the fish earlier, we'll start with the ones that take the longest to cook. When the shellfish are done, we'll remove them as well and place them in a large serving plate along with the fish and pour the broth into a soup tureen. In shallow bowls, we'll place a mix of fish and shellfish, ladle the broth on top, and serve with crusty bread. To add a nice finishing touch, place fennel fronds on top. And my friends, this is our bouillabaisse à la Marseillaise. Rich, flavorful, and visually appealing. This fish stew is a great dish to serve on special occasions. It's a lovely and elegant French meal your guests will love. I hope you give it a try soon and be sure to visit clubfoodie.com for ingredient amounts and more info. Until next time my friends, bon appétit!